Please stand. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Good morning, Frankfurt Hot Dogs, and welcome back on this morning. I'm your host, Ricky Hannon, and my guest host, Dallas Hatfield, the big dog, and stay tuned for more weather, news, and sports. But now on to weather with Victor. Thanks. When you came in today, the weather was at 32 degrees, but it feels like 21, with the wind speed at 16. When you go out for lunch, you're going to see rain. Then for the rest of the day, it's going to be cloudy and windy with snow showers. When you come in tomorrow, it's going to be 8 degrees, but it'll feel like negative 8. So make sure to bundle up. That's it for weather. Now back to Ricky and Dallas for more news. Thanks, Victor. For lunch today, we'll be having on lines 1 and 2, rotini. Line 3, hammer turkey wraps. And line 4, potato bar and cheese or buffalo wedge pizza. And line 5 is closed. A happy birthday today goes out to Jane Ferrer, Denise Mendoza, and Annie Morales. Now over to sports with Nick. Thanks. Over the weekend, the boys varsity basketball team faced both Crawfordsville and West Lafayette. The dogs ended up falling to Crawfordsville on Friday, 64 to 38. Jace Moore played one of his better game, played one of the better games of the season, and Caden Stein did a nice job on the boards. On Saturday, the varsity basketball team also fell to West Lafayette by a score of 62 to 34. Trey Frazier and Brain Compton were solid on the offense, with Trey also chipping in five steals on the night. The team will be traveling to Clinton Central on Wednesday. The wrestling team competed in their sectional on Saturday. The dogs ended up placing fifth amongst the 11 teams that were there. The team also had six wrestlers advance to regionals, the most ever in school history. The six wrestlers advancing, advancing to regionals are Elijah Anthony at 106 pounds, Josue Bautista at 113 pounds, Juan Campos at 120 pounds, Christian Matias at 170 pounds, Zeke Van Deventer at 182 pounds, and at 220 pounds, Jack Bond. Finally, a congratulations goes out to Jordan Anderson as she competed in the high school bowling semi-state tournament. Although she missed out on advancing the state finals, she might have received enough points to compete in the all-state tournament on March 2nd. She has made semi-state all three years that she has been on the team. That's it for sports. Back to Dallas and Ricky. Thanks, Nick. And DECA news for the 18 students competing at the Indiana DECA State Conference. The DECA After Dark State Preparation Calendar is posted. Stop by the DECA room and sign up for evening prep times. If you have any questions, see Mrs. Bishop. Stop by the DECA cart to purchase your DECA cookies for $1 a bag. Your choices of cookies include chocolate chip, M&M, snickerdoodle, and sugar. And music news. Congratulations to the to the band students who received gold at solo and ensemble. Woodwind Trio, Carmina Erzmendi, Bryn Lee, and Cassandra Lopez Carrillo. MJ Smith had a marimba solo. Brass Trio included Adric Mounts, Pat Patience Chamberlain, and Tyler Harper. Congratulations to the band students who received silver at solo and ensemble. Miracle Halflet, flute solo. David Mendoza, trumpet solo. Adric Mounts, trombone solo, Carmina Arizmendi, flute solo, uh, Gabby Reyes, clarinet solo, Patience Chamberlain, baritone solo, Victoria Moss, xylophone solo, Ella Regal, flute solo, Yahir Reese Roman, clarinet solo, Maddie McBee, tenor saxophone solo, Aranza Barrios, Skylum Gowan, and Olivia Ramos, trumpet solo, or trio. Also, congratulations to the band members of the large brass ensemble who received silver medals and were half a point from advancing the state. Adric Mounts, Hiro Valdez, Chris Darnell, Patience Chamberlain, TJ Chamberlain, Andy Nichols, Tyler Harper, Chris Guido, Aranza Barrios, Skylar McGowan, Olivia Ramos, Marcus Perez, Kennedy Wartz, and David Mendoza. Also, congratulations to FHS orchestra students who participated in ISSMA Solo and Ensemble Contest on Saturday, January 26th. FHS received all gold ratings including two violin solos and, tri and a trio that advanced the state contest. Our gold medalists were Everett Dick, violin, violin solo, Crystal Gomez, violin solo, Alex Kimboa, violin solo, 
Abigail Quinn Denon, violin solo in Group 1, Advancing to State. Addison Perryman, violin solo in Group 1, Advancing to State. Violin Trio with Abigail Quinn Denon, Crystal Gomez, and Addison Perryman, Group 1, Advancing to State. Great job, everyone. For the final bit of news, the bookstore will be closed Monday through Thursday this week. It should be back open on Friday, February 1st. That's it for Hot Dog News, Weather, and Sports. Please stay subscribed, and, and we leave you with this quote today. I am the protector of the deep. I am Aquaman from Aquaman. Have a great day, folks.